my two favorite Mayas of all time, the Death Adder Elite and the Logitech 403. The Dream, same performance, same shape, without the cable. Welcome to the Logitech G603. All right, guys, here's Torsen back with in full effect. And today, my review of the Logitech G603 Lightspeed Wireless Gaming Mouse. Let's go through some of the specs first and have an overview of the mouse. So, first of all, some facts the physical specifications of the mouse 124 millimeters in height, 68 millimeters in width, and 43 millimeters in depth. The weight is 88.9 grams with the mouse only, 112.3 grams with one battery and 135.7 grams with two batteries. The features, the next generation hero sensor which offers an exceptional performance and energy efficiency, light speed wireless, the advanced wireless performance of Logitech, then the advanced power management which features 500 hours of non-gaming experience with the one millisecond performance setting and the low setting which comes with an eight millisecond response time brings you 18 months of battery you can connect it to multiple devices so you can switch between different bluetooth devices you have connected the mouse to and then the price is around 70 bucks on amazon gamers looking for a new mouse are more likely than not interested in improving their gaming performance. Most likely shooters. If you belong to this group, do not buy a new gaming mouse unless you have at least a 144Hz monitor. If you are gaming on 60Hz, don't waste your money. Higher refresh rates will reduce your input lag on a very noticeable level. 60 to 144Hz is the biggest improvement you can make to your game. All right, still there? Okay, let's talk 603. The difference between new gaming mice these days is a very subjective thing. The performance of the sensor, for example, is not really noteworthy anymore if you get a mouse from a popular brand. PMW 3360 here, Hero sensor there. You will not feel a difference unless the mouse has some issues. All you need to know about the 603 is that it performs flawlessly. Perfect tracking, precision, etc. No matter how fast you spin it around your mouse pad, it won't break a sweat. However, the 603 is a wireless mouse. So the biggest question is, how much does the wireless connection compromise the experience? The precision. Again, put your worries aside, Logitech has mastered the wireless technology. In short, you will never ever feel a difference to a wired mouse. I can understand if you still have doubts, especially if you are an ambitious gamer. The only thing I can and will say is that I personally guarantee that this is the real deal. Flawless performance. A wireless mouse obviously needs a battery and the more efficient hero sensor is crazy. 500 hours in performance mode which offers the 1 millisecond latency is so good that I think Logitech actually undermines a new product they just released, the PowerPlay mousepad with the integrated wireless charging system. I am personally more than happy to change the battery every 500 hours instead of shelling out 150 bucks for a mousepad. The only downside of the batteries might be the added weight. As mentioned before, 112.3 grams with one battery and 135.7 grams with two batteries. I personally use it with two batteries and love the weight and the balance of the 603, but if you want the lightest mouse on the market, keep that in mind. For me, the added 20 grams or so in comparison to the 403 feel excellent and I have a very secure and stable aim. Honestly speaking, and as always I bought the 603 with my own cash, I cannot point out any flaws of the mouse. It is really hard to imagine how Logitech will step up their game going forward. There is really nothing anymore I could wish from a mouse. If a mouse is ideal for you or not, highly depends on whether it is a good fit for your hand or not. So if possible, check it out in a store first before you pull the trigger. If you like the fit, the 603 is one of the best mice ever released. 
All right, guys, I hope you liked the video and I hope I see you in the next one. Have a good one.